Well, hi baby. Happy Father's Day, December 9th. Boy, the days just kind of click on and tick on by here. It's like, where did the days go? I don't know. I don't know where the days go. Um, yeah, I'm working today. I, uh, I slept in this morning. I, I told you yesterday I wasn't feeling well and I could have stayed in bed all day today, but uh, it just didn't happen. So, um, <clears throat> anyway... Happy Father's Day, December 9th. You know, um, one of the things I think about is what do you do when you're frustrated, when you're grumpy, uh, maybe when you've been wronged, or when life isn't going your way, or um, you feel like you, things are unfair, and it makes you angry. Um... There's a lot of things. There's a lot of books. There's a lot of advice. There's a lot of old sage advice. There's a lot of sayings and counseling and suggestions that people can do when they're angry. Um, you can exercise. They say a lot of times physical exercise, getting it out physically, um, helps the body create the chemicals that it needs to cope and to digest those, those emotions. Uh, you can tell a friend. Sometimes you can talk. Sometimes if you just say what you're feeling um, to another person, someone that you love, uh, sometimes that can help and just feel better afterwards. Some people write. They can write it down. And, and oh, I, I, I'm a writer. I actually enjoy that. I can write it down and <clears throat> get it out that way. Other people go into their work. They work really hard. That's a little bit of me, too. I do that as well. Um, I, you know, do a lot more work, it seems like, when I'm frustrated with life or the world or when I'm not getting what I want. Um, a lot of people go into their hobby. They, maybe they sing or they, they write a song or write. Maybe they do pottery or they go to nature or, um, you know, try to distract themselves. Some people do that. Some people distract themselves from whatever it is, whatever emotion they're feeling, sometimes in good ways like with their hobbies and, and uh, like with talking or hanging with friends and other times in not so good ways with uh, drugs and alcohol and other things. So um, you want to know the biggest way? The biggest way to overcome your grumpiness, to make right what you think is wrong, to uh, find justice when there isn't any, when things aren't fair, when you're angry, you want to know the best and easiest way to overcome that? Just accept it the way it is. That's it. That's it. I was sick yesterday and I couldn't do my work and I was frustrated. <clears throat> I was lonely yesterday. I didn't have Courtney and my friends. And I was frustrated. My conversations with my mother in the past couple days haven't gone great. And I've been frustrated. I haven't been able to see you for... a hundred and eighty-five days. And I'm frustrated. It's costing a lot of money. Money that I could just give to you. And I'm frustrated. There are a lot of things to be frustrated and grumpy about at the end of the day. The best way to deal with it, in my opinion, is just to accept it. Sometimes, you just accept it. I was going to be sick yesterday no matter what. I was not going to be able to work as hard and as fast as I wanted to work. My mother's getting old, your grandmother's getting old. And I can't change that. Everyone else has their own lives and their own things to do and school and school projects and work and work projects and fun and fun projects they need to do and Sometimes they don't have time for me. Your mother and I are in a disagreement, and until that agreement comes to uh, balance again, we do this. So there you go. I didn't say it would be easy. Of all the things I just listed to do when you're grumpy or you feel like things have been unfair or you're frustrated that things aren't going your way, of all the things that I suggested, writing and singing and playing and distracting and working, exercising, the hardest is probably just to accept it. But 
It's the truest way to become unfrustrated and unangry. It's the most surest, most positive, most absolute way to do that if you can digest it and cope it and just accept it. You won't be angry anymore. You won't be frustrated anymore. You'll just be sick on your couch like I was yesterday. Not able to do much of anything. And sometimes the things that make us frustrated are meant to be. I don't know why. You won't know why sometimes either. But it's true. So, we do this and we keep doing this for 185 more days if we must. Sick days and healthy days, sad days and happy days. Not the show. And we do this because that's what we do. Every day, I'm giving something to you. And today, just like yesterday, and God willing, tomorrow, I'll give something then too. Happy Father's Day, December 9th, 2021. Accepting it as it comes.